What's up guys, welcome to episode 21 of Pokemon Legends Arceus. And yes, last episode we finally completed the main story of this game. There will be some side stories, you know, some tasks and stuff like that. But yeah, we technically finished the main part of the game. So let's head over in here and see what we have to do. This episode we may do some tasks, some side stories, you know, some... Try to find shiny Pokemon, maybe. I'm not sure though. But yeah. So, I trust you enjoyed yourself at the festival. Sure I did. Indeed. That only seems natural, given the crowd. I believe last night was the first time I've caught a glimpse of you making merry, Captain. I believe you must be imagining things. Now, Professor Laventon, to business. What is the current state of, the po of progress on the Pokedex? I dare say we made quite significant progress all in all though we could afford to put a little more effort into our research tasks and of course it is hard to know how far to go in pursuit of some reports certain pokemon have only been mentioned in history's legends after all who knows if they are even real with how little we know about his history's history and legends it seems a tall order for us to tackle pardon couldn't help to o but over here if it's history and history and legends you want, then I'm your man. Why? I believe I've spent plenty of time st studying such things instead of amen. I mean, while also tirelessly doing my work for Ginkgo Guild. And I've visited many of the ruins and whatnot here in history region already. I imagine I could teach you a thing or two about any Pokemon of legends in these parts. Oh ho, music to my ears. Listen well, Triaptor. You're to learn all you can from the merchant, Volo, and together as needed for the sake of the Pokedex. We meanwhile will also continue to gra gather intelligence on Pokemon by other means. Understood. I'll set up at the high camps. Then, Triaptor, I'll be expecting you. Okay, so there's a mission. Besides, I've got something to discuss with you two, so I hope you won't keep me waiting. So yeah, let's head over out here and see if there's any maybe mass outbreaks or something like that before we go. He's at the Heights camps, but yeah. How much Pokeballs do we have? Uh, with five Feather Balls. How much money do we have? 1,200, um, we'll buy, f no, we'll be fine, I think. So no mouse mass outbreak, so we'll head over to the Fieldlands camp where Volo said he would be. Here we are. Okay, where is he? Oh no, he's in the other camp. Oh well, on the way we'll just see if there's any Pokemon. Oh, Brave can't spawn here. That's weird. Can none of them spawn? Oh, Dialga can. That's weird. Okay, so we'll keep going then. Is Breviary. We should head back there to see if maybe mess spirit and stuff, maybe we could catch them. Okay, here's Volo. Traptor, there you are. Have a look here, if you will. A good, long, close look, please. See the patterns modelled after Pokemon? I've come to think these, the, they might be letters. Rather like hieroglyphs, if you will. I've inspected ruins across the region and having concluded they all seem to have the same tale. 
The tale of a brave soul who, together with the Pokemon at his side, went on a journey to search for the fragments of all encompassing de deity. A deity? Yes, an all encompassing deity, the creator of this very universe, and its name is Arceus. Perhaps you've already heard his name. It does sound familiar. Of course. What else could I have expected from the hero who saved the Hisui region? But now, let us discuss the fragments. They must surely be the plates. Yes, the very plates you collected as you were went around quelling all the frenzied nobles. Haven't you noticed they all have words carved on their backs? Go on, give them a read. You read the text engraved on the back of the first plate you obtained. The original one breathed al alone before the universe came. The ori this original one is none of the o than the other Pokemon known as Arceus. So what do you say, Chapter? I think we could we should try to gather all the plates. And I've just got the idea where to start our search. Join me in the heart of Grueling Grove. Okay, so yeah, I don't think this, so we got kind of a side story, so I don't think this episode will be doing that many tasks on this thing, or we might do none. We'll try to catch some Pokemon though. Like, you know, if we just see some, that could be useful maybe. Like, this one isn't that useful, but you know, it's still useful anyway. I hate when they run away. That was a Stantler, that's cool. That was close. Oh yeah, did you just attack you? I forgot about that. Let's head out of here. Ooh, what's this one? Is this like, is this one of the lakes? No, we're, we're the exact opposite direction. They probably won't catch it, but you know, it's, might as well try. Do some of the combi, I think they're called. Yeah, Combi, that's their name. Okay, that was so perfect. Okay, here we are. Now, Chapter, according to my own investigations. What? An Alpha Vespic Queen? Terribly sorry, Chapter, but do you think you can handle it? I think we should try to catch her. Go, Dali. Oh yeah, this will be easy. <laughs> we have Dali on our t side. Oh, so we need an impact. Yeah, I forgot about that. So, I don't want to make it faint. So what's ineffective? So, let's go to our Pokemon. What's ineffective with Dali? Mm -hmm. We could try Flash Cannon. Oh, wait there. We'll be fine though if it attacks us. Hopefully. Yeah, we'll be fine. Another one? Yeah, we'll just do another one. Hopefully that'll be enough. Mm. We'll use the leading bow now. One. Who escaped? Well, I think we could still win though. Because I think this would be a good Pokemon to catch. Because we don't have it yet. Huh? 
Okay, come on, please. One. Yes, we caught it. GG, guys. You obtained the stone plate. Stone plate. A stone in tabled imbued with the essence of rock. When used on a certain Pokemon, it allows that Pokemon to gain the power of rock type. Why did that alpha Pokemon have the plate we just were we were just looking for? Maybe it just happened to find the plate lying around. In any case, that's the only other plate that I had any information about. So that's it. Yeah, and yet yeah, there's nothing to seem. To, there's and yet yeah, nothing seems to be happening, which makes me suspect there must still be more plates left left out there for us to find. Not to worry though, I know the perfect person to ask. She's bound to know all about the plates, Mistress Cogita. The one and only Mistress Cogita. Yes, you haven't had the chance to properly thank her for helping, for for her help to obtain the red chain. Am I? Right? All the more reason to pay her a visit. So onward to the ancient retreat. Let's see if there's any Pokemon in here though. Any Pokemon? No, I don't see any. That's weird, I would expect more Pokemon to be here. That's a very scary one. Hair across. That doesn't see it, does it? That's weird. Okay, so where do we head now? So if we head over, if we go to the Heights camp. Oh, we're being targeted. I forgot about that. Sorry, guys. So if we go to the Heights camp, and then if we try to get there, maybe we'll see some stuff. Is there any mass outbreaks? No. Oh wait, is that where the ancient retreat is? Oh, that's a request. Okay, how do we get to the ancient retreat? Do you have to head back? Well, let's quickly go here and see our Pokemon. I want to see my Pokemon. Also, I think we can sell our Pokemon. We should sell them. We'd probably make a few, like, 10,000s. But let's see. What we... What could be useful. Oh, yeah, we got it. Rename Pal... Changed name pa from Palkia. Uh, Pally. I like Pally. That's a good name. Okay, so, there's nothing on our team we could really change. Like, I'm not sure about Gary, but yeah, Gary's always been with us, so we probably won't change. Yeah, but here we are. Okay, so, we have to head, no, that's, uh, I keep thinking that's what we where we have to go, but it's not. So, if we go out, we have to head back to the village. Oh, come on. Okay, there we go. So how do we head back? Okay, we've got six Pokemon. How do we get 3,700 for that? Oh no! Return to the village. There we go. Okay, so now we'll head back to the village and we'll quick- and then we'll go to the ancient retreat. Ooh, we'll quickly go here though. There's an outbreak. Where is this outbreak? Okay, good. It's close, so we can do it quickly.
Okay, let's see if there's any shinies. So far from the looks of it, there's not. I should get out of here. I caught a few of those beezles. So any more? There's still a few. Get out of here. <laughs> this could be good. We'll get a Pokeball. No, we should head back. Yes, okay, so now we have to head all the way back. We have to get away first so we're not targeted. Okay, there we go. So if we go back to the camp. And then if we head over to the professor. 1,800, that's not bad. But yeah, once we sell our Pokemon, we'll probably make, well, if we can, we'll make so much money. So I wanna return to the village so I can go to the ancient retreat. I think that's what it's called, but yeah. And then once we get there, we'll find out about the plates and everything. So there we go. I love this little, place it's so cute it's like a cotton a cottage but in pokemon legends arceus here we are okay so if we head inside oh lost one it's a miraculous what you have done it seems the red chain served its purpose well and you carried out your duty as you were bid. But what brings me you here? Have you yet need from me? It's about Arceus. Ah, yes. A tale whose origins lie in a millennium or two ago. Those were the days of the ancient Sino people, from whom I am descendants across many generations. Those four beers of mine worshipped Arceus. And as the Pokemon that created the Hisui region. And I ha have heard of certain fragments, plates, as they are, were called, are called, that, would, that were given to the ancestors of Pokemon, such as Cleavor and Weirdeer. Sorry guys, is that all? I thought you surely te could tell us more about Arceus and the plates. I'm afraid I have nothing to te new to tell you. Why, the Diamond and Pro clans would never have confused Dialga and Palkia with the creator. Arceus had anything concrete pass been passed down. If only we had more to go on, the answers to these mysteries may have shed light on why Traptor here fell from the sky. Aha, I see what you intend. Very well. I'll help as best as I can. There are still other tremendous Pokemon in Hisui. Of the mysterious to be solved. Whether they are connected to Arceus, I cannot say for certain, but in searching them out, perhaps you'll stumble upon the path you seek. Let me think. There are Pokemon of the lakes, of course, and the temple giant, the crescent moon, the volcano, and perhaps you might even return to the very beginning. Now then, what would you hear of? Um, I think the volcano sounds cool. Well, where could be but Spire Spit Island. Now then, what would you hear of? The three lake Pokemon? Ah, yes, them, you already know. Go give them your thanks for the red chain and show them how strong you've become. The Crescent Moon? Yes, the moon. You must go where you may meet the moon's gaze unobstructed. Does that clue illuminate your path well make for the coronet highlands for now 
the temple giant. The secret that lurks in Snowpoint Temple. To find it, you must open the door that is sealed. And the beginning. Indeed, a beginning for you, certainly. Where was it all you first fell to earth here? Now then, what would you hear of? Never mind. Any questions for you? Okay, there. Very well, lost one. The rest depends on you and your efforts. It appears that Pokemon of the space-time rift is compelled Pokemon that might otherwise have stayed hidden to come out and see what has befallen the world. I hope you succeed, for your own sake and for the, that of the Pokedex you labor on. I knew we could rely on you, Mistress Cogita. That's more interesting than any enough information to work with. Now let us find those plates. So I think this fires... I like the volcano one because that sounds pretty sick, so we'll probably head there first. It's just as I had six suspected. Pokemon are the key to our search, Traptor. If we get, can gather all the plates from them and decipher the message on the backs of these of the plates at last, perhaps we can meet Arceus itself. You should go search for the Pokemon that got you to mention, Traptor. I have my own avenues of research that I'd like to pursue. Arceus, creator of history. I truly can't wait to see what kind of Pokemon it might be. So yeah, our team's all ready. I think we should head over to Firespell Island. I've had a message from Mistress Cogita. I'm told you were collecting plates of some sort of Merchant Volo with the Merchant Volo. Then we must go to Prelude Beach. Meet me there. Okay, so I guess we're heading to Prelude Beach. So I think the first thing I'll do quickly is head over here and buy some feather balls. Okay, so we need... I think we'll do 40, Fif we'll do 50, 44, that's fine. And then if we head over here, if we go to feather bows, we can craft 44. Is there, where can we sell our Pokemon? Hi there, we've got great stock in at the moment. Here's all the good girls, good goods I got right now. Anything catch your eye? No. Okay, so let's head out right now and go to the volcano place. So where would that be? Oh no, uh, we had to meet Kamado at the beach. Wait, let's see Pally. Pally looks pretty sick because, like, I really like how Pally looks and, Dial and Dialga. They look pretty sick, honestly. Can we ride Weird Deer right now? The Zaletos? No. This is where we started the first part of this uh, Let's Play, kind of. Wisp. I've never seen that. <laughs> okay, let's quickly collect that wisp. There are five wisps remaining in this area. Hmm. Wait, before we go... Oh no, we can only go this way. 
He has his armor on. That's pretty cool. Prelude Beach. Indeed, a place of beginning. Now, it is not time for words. Face me in battle. Yes? Okay. We'll battle him again. We have Diago and everything, so we'll be fine. Golem, uh, Golem, we'll send Bravey. Let's see what we can do with Bravey. Nothing that effective. Um, we'll send in Pally. And then what, what can we do? We do Hydro Pump Strong Style. I oh, know we can't. Okay, Aqua Tail Strong Style. Okay, that's good. Hopefully he sends out something weak to fire, like, uh, I mean water. I don't know how we'll do against Snorlax. It has Fire Punch. That's interesting. Um, I don't want to fight yet. I want to see what we have on Pali. We'll send in Leafy because Leafy is now the only effective one. So hopefully it doesn't use Fire Punch against Leafy because Leafy is weak against fire types. So what attacks can Leafy do that's effective? It can use Aura Sphere Strong Style, which is apparently super effective. It didn't do much damage, but if this hope if this okay it did kill us. Okay, well faint make us faint. So if we send in now uh hmm. We're sending Pally again. And then we'll use Spatial Rattling. And then we'll use another spatial rend, and then we defeat her. Oh, we restored it to its full health. Okay, how about an Aquato Strong Style? The Snorlax is pretty strong. Giga Impact? With the burn? Okay, no. So if we use another Swiss Facial Rend, we avoided the attack. Okay, so we fainted. Spiky could be good later. So we're sending Dally. And we'll do Iron Ten Tail Strong Style. Oh, that was good. That was good. I don't know why I didn't say super effective, but that was a really good attack. Heracross now, that's interesting. Pid missile, that barely does anything. And then sword dance. So stats would be raised. So. Nothing very super, nothing super effective. We'll send out Bravey. Hopefully it's next Will we attack? No. Will this be effective? No. We'll be fine. So, if we do Brave Bird Strong Style. There we go. Oh, we were really damaged by recoil. Who has a bravery area also? Quick attack. Oh, Spikey can use Ice Bow, which is super effective. It didn't do that much, but we'll s if we do a few more attacks, we'll be able to get her. A... 
Okay, it knocked us out. So, let's see what we could use. Ooh, we can use Gary. Yeah, this is good. Okay, we're, we're doing really good. Okay, so if we use Crunch Strong Style, hopefully this will knock it out in one shot. There we go. Okay, so let's see his last Pokemon. Clefable. Okay, use Calm Mind. That's good because it only heals it, I think. Oh no, it's, it raises its stats. Let's see what attacks we can do. We'll send in Daily. Or Dally. Yeah, we'll send, it's Dally. And then, what can Dally do? It can do an Iron Tail Strong Style. There we go. GG, guys. Even frightful creatures like Pokemon can be powered, can be, become powerful allies. Ooh, both of them leveled up. You've grown much even stronger since we faced on another on one another on Mount Coronet. It's clear you do not view Pokemon as dangerous enemies, but rather as trustworthy allies, allies who with whom you can reach great heights. Perhaps you are a divine being yourself, sent to bring us gifts from above. Hey there, you should have this. You received the first plate. First plate, a stone tablet imbued with the essence of the fighting spirit. When used on a certain Pokemon, it allows that Pokemon to gain the power of fighting type. When the very first of our galaxy expedition team, myself, Benny, and the others set foot on Prelude Beach, we found that plate. It clearly holds some kind of power, and so I've kept it safe all this time. I find it fitting that I, it should now end up, up with you, who, likewise, arrived here on the same beach. Perhaps something is guiding us. Indeed, it must be so. You and I, Adaman, Arida, it did appear we are all being guided by one called Old Mighty Sino. Hmm. It might be more appropriate to call this region the Sinnoh region. I know I've got no right to say this, but we are truly fortunate to have been able to count you among the Survey Corps ranks. If you had not joined us, we would have fallen on Mount Coronet. We would have lost our home. We would have lost our future. Now then, carry on with the survey work. The knowledge that you collect about the wild Pokemon of this region will serve to illuminate our path towards as forward as we walk into the future. Based on Koja's hints, it seems there are be four more plates left for you to find. Okay, but yeah, I think I'm going to end the video here, guys. But yeah, I hope it's a bit of a quick video, but I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I'm really happy we finished, well, last episode we managed to catch Pally. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and see you in another Tractor video. And next episode we'll try to get another plate. See you, bye.